Hello, welcome to Stay Outside and Explore. Well, we picked this instep little buggy, if you want to call it, that hooks up to my bike. And then I'll have another hookup with my wife's bike. So we can put our two-year-old granddaughter in there, strap her in, and we can take her for a spin. My other oldest granddaughter, she can ride her own bike, but the two-year-old, yeah, she's got a little learning to do yet. So, I got this um, bracket that goes on to here. Got it from Amazon, ordered it last night, came today. So, while I'm digging this out, why don't you go down where the subscribe button is and if you haven't subscribed yet it would be awesome if you did i really would appreciate it and anybody that has subscribed to my channel well welcome back i appreciate it and uh we'll have another good video so let's start out with it's supposed to go like something like this i think and then this mounts to like that. All right. So let's take off that protective cap on there. And let's see, I'm gonna go with the 916s. That was a 5.8s, wow. Let's go on 1116s. I bet it's metric. 17. Nope. 18. Right on the money. Number 18. So, take this off. So, they're pretty tight. Wasn't coming off, that's for sure. I didn't want that to happen. Okay. Let's see now. There it is. I'm like, where the heck did I go with it? So... You're supposed to put one of these washers like so. I'm gonna take this washer out, put this washer like that. Then it interlocks with the frame of the bike. And then you can put this like that. Maybe this washer will fit. What do you know? It's like everything was made for it. All right, tighten it up. All right, I'm just gonna snug it for now, and let's get the trailer buggy hooked up just to make sure I did it okay. Looks like it'll fit okay. And like that, I have it. So I'm guessing this little strap here, I mean, 
Should I put it on the spokes? <laughs> no. Could I go like this? Something like that. I don't know. If somebody uh, says I'm doing it wrong, please leave a comment down below and let me know if that's what I'm supposed to be doing. So, let me tighten this bad boy up. And we'll take it for a spin. Okay, not going anywhere. Oh, and I even could put the cap back on. Look at that. I don't know how long. Yeah, it should stay. Okay, now I'm going to uh, take the bike for a ride and we'll see how this uh, works out. Alright, let's go for a ride. I gotta put it in the tires. Now you'll know what it's like to be in this scooter or this buggy. Okay, how'd you like the ride? Okay, put the air in the little buggy. Got that on my wife's bike. You can see it's my wife's bike. And then I put that on my bike. So either one of us can take the little one out when we want to. All right. I thank everybody watching. I hope this was informational to someone. If they're debating, you know, this are we got Schwinn electric bikes, and I got these um, little trailer hitch things off of Amazon. Uh, two of them were like twenty-four bucks or something like that, so not bad. All right, she's a hot one today, steaming. Um, Probably close to 90. Humidity is probably 75. The deep, I mean, the dew point, I'm on 75. She's a sticky one. But in a few months, we'll have snow. So I guess we can take this over the snow anytime. Again, thanks for watching, and we'll see you again next time.